What? What's going on? I'm confused. Um. Yeah, that that was that was different. <laughs> Okay, so where do where do I go from there? Does anybody know? Is it in here? Oh, it's on planet. Ah, okay. All right, I guess we'll try this one. That whole experience messed my eyes up. sell some thrusters <laughs> see if I didn't have a beard that would probably would have looked way more um, crazy but the fact that I have a beard kind of like kills it right Oh, it looked like a fake. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> nice. Man, this is going to be a lot of searching, though. Like, what if I don't find anything? Like, this is going to take a while. We need this money, though. There's got to be an easier way to make money. I mean, I can't in my right mind fathom making matrixes to sell. Like, I need matrixes for everything. Why would I want to sell them? It's got to be another way to make money that doesn't cut into my operation. Dude, big hype. Look at that, dude. 1300 freaking dollars raised by a uh, script, dude. That's freaking insane, man. Congrats on that, dude. Very cool. You make a lot of money selling guns? Really? You can't make that much money, dude. Like, I, I need money. I need, like, millions of dollars. 
one million dollars. They're actually 130 million according to Jay Randall. I was just thinking maybe there was a chance that like he changed it and nobody noticed and you could mine on planet I guess not what do I need money for uh station services stuff like that um if I'm gonna start getting into Xerox like turrets and stuff, I need to be able to like get the ammo and stuff, so I think, um, I actually think Imperion is very CPU heavy, not, um, graphics heavy. But it might be that? I mean, if you're in a really cool environment and it's not being used a lot, I don't, they don't always spin, right? Well, they do for me where I live, but... Oh, it's the other way around? Oh, okay. I thought it was really CPU heavy. So it's... Maybe I'm thinking of another game. Okay, fair enough. Sorry, don't listen to me. Well, that's true. I mean, I'm I'm at 38% CPU right now. Uh, I guess that's true. Never mind. That'd be a cool place to have a base right there, man. That looks awesome. The mists of Avalon. Cool. Oh, I bet. That's awesome, dude. Congrats. Big upgrade. Oh, 
I forgot this thing's backwards. I'm like, what's going on there? I'm going east, not west. Wow, nine years, dude. That's big. Are there no factions on here? So, is there anybody that's actively selling thrusters to anybody? Is there anybody that's doing that currently? No, 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 I don't want to buy any. I want to sell them, but if if you already have somebody you're selling them to, I'd, you know, I'd sell them to you for a cheaper price and you could still make a profit. I just want to get rid of these, make a little money. But I, I really need to find out how to make some money, man. On a moon at Persephone? Oh, I'm on my way. Oh, I'm on my way, sir. Going to Alpha Space. Oh, and I just gotta find alpha space again. Jeez. Um, oh God, I don't know where I'm going. Thirteen hour stream, Jesus. What were you doing, man? Holy shit. Some rest, man. Rumble's putting up big numbers.
I don't have navigational data. I got data pads. I don't know what that is. So how do you get navigational data? That's the mission thing and all that? Is it moon one or moon two? Yeah, Chester. Okay. Okay. All right, we'll do. We'll do, we'll do. Nice. If we can get rid of these, like, man, it's going to be good. Yeah, I agree. That'd be nice. Need to promote more trade. Damn it! Back to farm the. F I got to get on that, dude. You got to help me out with that script. You got to tell me how to start that process, cause I, honestly though, I really want a dark matter warp drive. Like I really want to get one. So you, if you could just tell me how to start that process, you don't have to tell me now, but maybe it'll be a time you come in and actually explain it, or rig, or somebody can come in and help me out to begin that. Shuts their flipping fiber, man. That's rough. Really? Really, Rig? Alright, well, can I have yours or. I'll take one. You lost it? How'd you lose it? Oh, bro. How did you lose it? That's scary. Oh! 
Oh, okay. I thought you had one for this. Uh, I thought you had one for season two. Okay. My bad. My bad. No, no. I thought you had another one for season two. I, I just figured you already had one. What, what are you waiting on? So, hello? Hey! What's up, man? Uh, all good, how about you? I'm good, dude. Nice. So, um, about the warp drive and the whole process. Um, on season one, you have you had to go through this uh, progenitor gate, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. You couldn't take your ship with you, though. So you had to spawn in a new ship on the other side. And un get everything to warp back. You had to stay there pretty much, or just warp with your character. Now with the navigational data, you can warp up to 150 or 160, I think. And that basically kills the whole progenitor gate. You can just warp there without doing all this fancy stuff. Ah. And just go back and forth. On that space, you're just going on the planets. There are something like those um, monuments. And each monument has one fragment. And you have to farm up to 100. Basically, each it's basically just yeah. Sorry. So you're saying each what has? What um, there are uh, monuments, and in those oh. monuments, um, there are loot boxes. You know, the, the ones that you find from POIs. Yeah. And each loot box has one fragment. You need up to hundred. It's basically just a lot of grinding, ah. going around grinding. Okay. And a lot of voidium. And, and that's stuff. it. That's all you need. You just need that and oh, voidium. Um. Voidium, you need 500 drone fragments. You need, um, tell me, I, th I don't know if you need the uh, magma site. I'm not sure, but you need those voidium um, containers, the big ones. So it's basically just time consuming and grind. Uh, I mean, as long as it gets me, you know, I mean, boy, that's going to be awesome on a Helios. Yeah. I mean,. If you do a lot of POIs or the quests, you can get those navigational datas, right? I am currently, I can almost warp the entire 150 or 160. And that is, for now, that is also enough. That's pretty it's good. It's better than yeah. 60 to go, go around. It's pretty pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty good for being like a fifth as good as 500, but. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, I want. It's not much grind, right? <laughs> I want the dark. Dark matter thingy. Gotta get it. Is this guy cool? Hey, bro, are you cool? Yeah, he looks cool. What? So, okay, so where do I go from here? Wait, what? There's nothing here. I've been lied to. This is a ruined. Wait, oh, they want. Somebody wants you to explain navigational datas. Um, navigational datas are there. There is a cre uh, quest from the UCH, I think. I think Garman did that, and that nets you, uh, I don't know, 10, 15 in total. And what navigation data is is basically it's one light year that you can warp more, and, and it is bound to your character, not to your ship. And the normal warp drive is times one, and the advanced warp drive warp drive makes it times two. So with one navigational data, you can pretty much warp Ooh, two light gifts. I found it. Look at this guy. Look at this champ. Look at this guy buying all the thrusters and shit. <laughs> what? All right, so I have to have this shit physically on me or no? Uh, you can use the connected toolbar for that. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. 
It's about to be all the way on. Someone's gonna be rich right now, guys. <laughs> I don't know if you guys could just talk to me after this. I might be a little too, little too good. I don't know. Let's see, let's see how much money we get here. What do we got? Small thrusters. I'll sell. Oh, I'll sell. Yeah, I got like twenty-one of them. Ho ho ho! Hello. Good day to you. All right, medium thrusters. What are we doing? What are we doing? Look at that money. That's money right there. What? Large thrusters? What? You want to buy large thrusters? Oh, that's all you, you don't want to buy anymore? Can I sell you some more? Hey, what if I could sell you? Wait, what the f This guy's. That's all he wants? You don't want any more? Oh, this guy. This guy doesn't want to buy any more off me. Script, what's going on? He doesn't want to buy any more. He, he's, he's, that's it? That's all you want? What ship only takes five thrusters? Stupid bot. His pockets are not that seriously. <laughs> like, what do I do now? I don't, what? Okay, I guess you wait uh, an hour for the reset. Oh, you gotta wait an hour? Is that the magic number? Uh, from what I know, the normal trainers are set to an hour. The ones on Anvil City are set to ten minutes. Damn it! All right, it's it's uh, it's three eleven. Oh wait. All right, guys, uh, go ahead and do what you gotta do for the next hour. I'm just gonna stand here. <laughs> We're gonna get this money. Or or maybe I should just go attack something on this moon. Actually, I bet you know I could salvage this thing and make more money. Oh. The Plutus is cool, but it's not that cool. Like, money's cooler. Right? What's the Xenu mainframe? What's that about? Is that a thing? I don't give a shit. Let's go see what it is. I don't... Fuck, I ain't got nothing to do. I was gonna go... It's easy, Luke. Yeah, I was gonna go shoot shit with the... Uh... Oh, crap. We're not on the uh, floaty moon. You know, he really should have made a ramp for this thing. I'm gonna give him shit for this. He's gonna be like, oh, it's not meant for planet. Then I'm gonna give him anxiety. It's gonna be awesome. <laughs> uh, day's awesome, man. I mean, if you need money, you can also just go hunt uh, infectors. Send the stuff from that. Dude, I am going to be visiting this place very often. <laughs> Is there like a money icon? No. To a to a pin. We'll put a pin in it. Boom. He buys thrusters. Go. Yes, go. Ha <laughs> ha! All right, let's uh, I don't know what a Xenu mainframe is, but we're gonna go like jack it up here. That's a drone base. You think that Plutus could take on a drone base? I'm, I'm, I don't think so. I have my reservation. Dude, I don't know. I'm feeling kind of, feeling kind of luxurious right now. I got a million bucks. I, I don't even know what I need to buy, but I could buy it. Just wait until you need to buy ammo. <laughs> Those yeah. will be gone instantly. No. Yeah? Really? It's a vicious cycle, yeah. man. Defense on ammo, but if you go towards the tier 2 um, stuff, then yeah, the ammo is pretty expensive. Ah. Oh. Let's see what we got comms on. That anti-aircraft tower is scary. Scary business, sirs. Oh, there's this new mainframe over there. Gonna get gold spinners on the landing gear? Hell yeah. Gold Dayton's on the freaking landing gears, dude. Freaking awesome. Dude, I'm telling you, that's, dude, that is why streaming is awesome, dude. Cause yeah, somebody just like hooked it up, dude. 
I'm surprised there's not a line out here, just like people like waiting for that hour. Like, I'm gonna sell all my thrusters. Might have to lock this moon down. Build a build a big ass wall around this area. <laughs> can't you have traders? Wait, can't you have traders like in your thing? No. Nope. That's lame though. I never mind. I think that's stupid. I just thought about that. No, well technically you could though. Yeah. I mean, if anybody knows, it'd be you, Mister Mister Crew. <laughs> no. Um. <clears throat> Last on last season, there was there were those colonists, right, on some uh, planets, mm -hmm. and they had traders in them. Also, some pol uh, Talon, some Cyrex POIs. And what you do is you take over the POI, destroy the core, and then you can just change the trader to your settings, what you want. You can set the reset timer to one minute. He can sell whatever he want. You want. Oh wow! It's pretty cheesy though. Yeah, yeah, it feels kind of yeah, yeah. I like it. Especially back then, uh, he buy, he bought Sino one Sino block for twenty k. Oh wow! And he bought, I think ninety of them each reset. Jeez. Yep. Nah. See, I, I like the journey. Like I like this, and this isn't too terribly far. Like I mean, it's a, it's a little bit of a journey, but it's like yeah, it just it's a nice little process, you know. Go kill some shit. Yeah. Collect the things, sell the things. Oh, is this that floating bullshit? Oh, I remember this. Oh, it wants to shoot at it. But it can't, because it doesn't have any of the right boom booms. Damn I, it. I think Vermillion did a new one of that as well. I'm not sure, though. Because the old one was pretty easy. You can just rush in, get the three, rare, uh, three boxes, and then go out again. gonna be a bad idea guys is it set to your home spot <laughs> oh all right good good call yeah it's about to be a it's about to be a bad day for some xerax see if i could jump this though oh god no oh god no oh god no <laughs> no No! Oh no! No! Well, shit. Yeah. Well, all right. Try that again. <laughs> Stupid shit. <laughs> well, I I I really thought I was gonna be able to jump that, but I guess not. I'm so used to my I mean, planet. Technically, you could also just land on top of it. This this is true. That's a good idea. But then, yeah, no foolproof plan. I can't yeah, even get up only... here now. Even now that this thing's <laughs> on the damn ground, it's freaking. Why didn't he put a ramp on this thing? You know what? Hold on, we're gonna build a ramp. Sick of this. I'm always having to fix Jay Randall's builds. Damn it. Hold on. Ramp. Ram oh, I haven't unlocked ramps yet. Hey, hold on. Be right back. I feel like we're in the Matrix, you know? It's like, strap me up to the chair. Teach me how to make ramps. What was the guy's name? Switch? Yeah. No, Switch was the girl. What was, what was his tank? There you go. Tank was the, uh, the operator guy. Seriously, I don't have motors. 
Mother freaking hell, man. I said, oh, maybe it was pointing to the wrong thing. Oh, we'll cannibalize this anyway. Wait, really? What? The hell did. What do you. Motors require that I don't have. I got all the basic shit. Freaking trees. I don't have any trees. Mother flipping hell, man. Oh, there's no trees anywhere. Yeah, there's not gonna be any trees. No, we're screwed. We're screwed. We're not screwed, like, but I don't want to take deco off of this thing. No, we're just gonna champ it out. We got this. Alrighty. Yes, yet, yeah, no. Uh, yeah, I could do that. I could put a door or something. Yo, oh, no. Whose idea was this? This was your idea. Script. Oh, oh, rock hype. Oh, he saw, he saw the freaking air I got off that rock. What? Tony Hawk the hell out of that shit. That was awesome. We did it, guys. Oh, that's the new plus has a med chamber on it. Right? All right, so I'm going to do it like halfway so that if I do have to turn it off to bring it down, like let's say I fall off it, even though it's on top, it can still like fall down to the ground, right? That's smart. Maybe. Oh, well, let's do it this way, that way. Yeah, I'll take the drop ship. Well, but I like having the miner. Being able to mine is is freaking a must, dude. Like especially when you're traveling and you don't know where you're going. Like you got some opportunity mines, like shit. Reload way faster in Siege.
Ow. I literally only done this once, so forgive me guys if I look like I don't know what I'm doing. It's because I don't! A lot of carbon though. Alright, top floor clear. Horrible entry point. Open wound, open. I'm so sick of these open wounds. Holy crap, man. Yeah, cheeky. Open wound, yeah. Is that it? I don't see any... Am I blind? I don't see anything here.
Script, you still here? Uh, yep. I don't see any. There's there's loot here? I don't see any loot. Um, the good loot is upstairs. Oh. Yeah, the elevator goes up too. Oh shit, I don't think I've done this upstairs. Those are not red boxes. That was bullshit. Seriously? Uh, there's still one. Uh, it looks like a cargo box. You know where you destroyed the first sentry? No, but... Oh, over here, yeah. Yeah, it's a red cargo box. That's the ultra rare PY box, I think. Whoa! That was... What the freaking hell was that, you bastard? Rockets, I'm so trash. I really need to work on personal ammo. Oh, five bridges. Damn it, 20 minutes have gone by. I don't think we're gonna. I don't think I'm gonna be able to justify their hour at this stupid moon. Alright, I mean, that was, that was something. Yay, yay us. You could technically do the whole storyline. You what? The, why? <clears throat> you what? Because the mainframe is connected to a big ass RX POI on the moon. Uh, to do, for what though? Like, what, what do I get? I think there are also a few loot containers. I think one or two ultra rares, I'm not sure though. And to kill time, I guess. <laughs> no, I'm good. We got other things to do. I mean, at least I've identified where I can sell these things, right? That was the big thing. You sure it's not 10 minutes? It's really an hour? Um, yep. Only Anvil is set to 10 minutes. Damn it. Persephone Moon 1 is mine! I mean, you could, you could still check it though. Oh. Like, uh, Ooh, uh, enter, not so sure now, so huh? Cool. No, when you entered, maybe the reset was uh, on the f uh, 50 minutes already, and it, after 10 minutes of reset, you never know, right? Oh, right? You never know. That's a good point. Where are my shields then? the frick? Oh, I put that generator on there.
need to find infectors, man. Yeah, the infect for me, the infectors are the best way of getting, well, quantums and good loot as well, because one infector has five ultra boxes in it. Yeah. Have you found any uh, good black holes or anything? Like, not really, right? I farmed the black holes at the beginning. Now I'm just going towards uh, legacy space all the time. Yeah. Really, I haven't seen any cheek. I've seen one, and it didn't have any legacy anything on it. What the hell's going on, yo? I think you marked the iron deposit instead of the POI. Shit! <laughs> Damn it. Complete it. So where do you go to start that, uh, Ice Vulcan? That's something I, I, I wouldn't want to do that without Jay, though, because I know Jay wants to do his little missions. Now, if we do that, do each of us get that, or just one of us? That'd be cool. We gotta do that. Ah, yeah, we're gonna have to do that. What's up, buddy? Oh, look at you. D oh, no. Yeah, no. No. Damn it. Well, fine. Leather. Oh, this guy's selling. Oh, he wants to buy leather. I don't have any leather, buddy. Sorry. Anything else? No. It's, it's, uh, yeah. Well, I'll be back, guy. Not guy. Oh, I'll be back. We're gonna be here quite often, sir. Making all that money. Shit, I, I never forward think when it comes to this, like, damn it, I should have parked, like, more up. Damn it, Jay. It's Jay's fault. He, I mean, why would you not give access for those that stubbornly want to use this on planet? Alright, I got this little parkour action. You ready? Sure, that didn't work.
can't you also just put elevators on the bottom part to hop in easier? Yeah, no, I'm just gonna uh, I'm just gonna put a ladder. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna put a ladder here. Really, really piss them off. Guards making fun of me, yeah. We did it, guys. We actually accomplished a mission we were set out to do in a stream. That is insane. Holy shit. My title will actually make sense when people go back and watch this stream. Well, not really, because, like, the first part of it is just me with really weird faces and stuff. But after that, we, d we did Welcome stuff. To XBC. Yeah, look at that. Orizon Alpha with the three-month resub. Legit. Karambit time, hell yeah. Big hype. Welcome to XBC. Look at that. Eight month resub from Talzar. What's up, man? Long time. Hope you're doing good. Nice! Whetstone hone hype. Making a huge dreadnought, nice. Whoa! Cheeky shenanigans with the Prime 13th month resub. Thank you for creating this great community and giving us a place to share and enjoy this game. XBC. Awesome, dude. Thank you so much, man. Thank you for being an integral part of it. It's a whole freaking hype train, man. Very cool. What? 
Oh. Popping some bits, nice. Thank you. 80% hype train. Dude, we can make money now. Like, I'm, I'm legit excited, dude, now that... Because, like, it's it was such a mystery, you know? And now it's not a mystery anymore. Now we know how to possibly make some damn money. Well, I mean, we did. Like, we legit made money. I don't know what I'm going to buy, but... It doesn't matter. I mean, you got money. I don't know. I might, I might be the richest person on the server. I'm just saying. That might be a thing. Let's see here. Let's see. Let's let's check. Let's check the roster. Where are we at here? Um, trade volume. Oh, <laughs> I'm seventy one. I'm seventy one. Holy crap, dude! One hundred and fifty five million in trade. That's that's nuts, dude. Look at script with the most warped light ears. This freaking guy. <laughs> They're all over the place. And I think we're almost out of coffee. <laughs> Nonsense, dude. We've got <laughs> plenty of coffee. <laughs> <laughs> coffee height. Thank you for the bits there, Jarvis. 95%. Hey, Darkest, what's up, man? Popping it, success. Big hype, dude. Big success. Why did I see the gold already? That's scary. That means somebody's already done it. But it said undiscovered, right? That is a successful hype train. Level one complete. I wonder if uh, I keep looking too. I don't know. Nah. Well, this is a lot closer. So I don't know. I need to. I need to find a black hole. If I can find a black hole. Wait, there's a multi turret on here. This comes stock with a multi turret. Oh. Or wait, did I do that? I did this, right? I don't think he would. No, did he do that? Since when J. Randall knows how to do signals? Damn it, who taught him how to do that? That's scary. See how satisfying that is with the lasers? Oh my god. That is extremely satisfying. It's actually gold, guys.
Target acquired. Take your gold. All right, what else are we doing? Take a lot of good stuff here. Let's, let's continue. Uh, so I reset this in a few minutes, though. Damn it! Oh, that's <laughs> right. Yeah. So I've realized that um, my internet goes down at five forty-six Eastern every day. So if I start the stream early, they can't get me. Haha. -ha. So I um like right right after I um ended the stream yesterday, it um it restarted. It was hilarious. Alright guys, a little five minute break here. I'm gonna grab a drink real quick while this restarts.
Oh, cold pear. Oh, it's green, so you can't see it. Ooh. Ooh, is the server up yet? Huh. I don't have a garden. You should know me better than that. Mm. Mm. There is up. Last bite. Mm. K-bar height. Oh, K-bar karambit. Wait, there's a tugboat? What the? It may be a tugboat, but is it a tug of hawk? I don't think so. I'm betting it's not. Peaches are alright. I like peaches, I like plums. I like apricots, I like pears, I like um I like red pears, those are good. I like apples, but I'm not into like red apples so much. Like I, I well, I like the Granny Smith stuff. I like the uh there's there's like a red and yellow apple that's really good that I get locally. A lot of flavor. I like pears. I, I'm not really into like sweet stuff like that, so Pear is a poor man's apple. <laughs> is it though? Hey, Tig, what's up, man? Hmm. Hmm. That sounds good. Now I want a beer. Damn it! I'm gonna go get a beer. Let me see if I have one. No beer, guys. Sucks. I don't know, Cheeky, but I think we need one. Is there an admin in the chat? We need one. 
We need thruster vendors. We need thruster vendors. That's my wife to buy me beers. She buys me two beers. It's like, thanks. <laughs> I'll ration these for the week. It's like, Rrr. Damn, ex cow. I couldn't sleep the baby. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. It's a pear. It's not an apple, it's a pear. 
I'll eat bananas, but I prefer them in my sandwiches with peanut butter. Peanut butter and banana sandwich type. Oh, hello, Neodymium. Neodymium. I've been saying Neodymium with the N instead of M for like five years. I like red wine, dude. That, that's the way to go, especially at night. Nice glass of red wine, that's good. I can relate. Fanta for yuck! Oh, what? No! No! Dude, I can teach you how to make a painkiller, dude. You wanna drink rum? I, I, got, I got all that for you, man. I got all that for you. Make you a painkiller, man. Get you some orange juice. Get you some pineapple juice. Um, three parts pineapple, one part orange. Um, a little bit of Coca Lopez, rum, strong as you want it. Shake that shit up. Put a little nutmeg on the top. That's good shit right there. We'll just do a uh, do a rum punch, man. Just buy some freaking Welch's fruit punch or whatever. Like, just yeah, that would be better. I mean, I guess it's not. It's like a Cuba Libra, but like fruity. I mean, I guess that's fine. Do what you got to do, man. You could, okay, buy a pineapple, buy an, like, what are you guys talking about? You don't have pineapple juice and orange juice? Even I have that. Ginger beer is good too, yeah, yeah, that's a good one. Oh yeah, I don't really drink rum anymore at all, dude. Like when I first when I first moved down here, um, you know I was bartending like full time at the beach bar and oh, we would um, there's a distillery that's owned by the uh, family that I worked for the bar and it's cane rum so it's made from sugar cane so it's a bit different and oh, I can't even smell it. It makes me sick even smelling it. Yeah, no, it's it's nuts, dude. I think the most recent bartending thing I did, like right before we closed down for COVID, um, there was this group from from the states, and it was like it was three couples, three married couples, older. 
and you know those were my only customers they were on beach chairs and um they were ordering the uh, mellow moods from me which is like the bar special basically it's um it's basically a rum punch with coconut so you know they they loved it the girls loved it because it was pink it was just they were just digging it and i must have made like 30 of those and they got so they got so lit that like <laughs> they invited me on their boat trip like they're like you need to come with us and bartend on our boat trip we're going out for seven days and i was just like no, i can't <laughs> they're like oh come on you know you gotta come it's gonna be amazing you know we'll pay you it'll be great uh, i was like yeah i was 20 maybe but no I got, I got responsibilities and stuff sorry but yeah no rum messes you up especially in the sun on the beach Right. Yeah, see, I like tequila. That's me. I'm a tequila fan. I, I'm like when I was at the bar, I, I would make margaritas for myself, and nobody else really drank margaritas. That's more of a. Uh, Pacific Ocean thing. So yeah, we'll just sit there and drink margaritas all night. Tequila goes down good too, and you don't get, you know, it doesn't mess your head up like rum and stuff. Especially good tequila, you get some good stuff, yeah, it's good. When I was in, uh, I only ever went on one cruise. To I went to, uh, I went to Cozumel, and we went to a tequila tour, and it was, it was pretty cool. Boss man with the six monther man, battle axe time. Hell yeah, it's been six months, dude. That's awesome. Big hype, dude. Appreciate it, man. Oh man, cheeky this row. Yeah, that's cool. We don't we don't really get that deep into the little minutiae of the build, so you, you should be fine. Not gonna call you on stuff like ventilation and airtight stuff. We don't really check that.
no. That, I don't know. You might have to pull it. Sixty four, seriously? Held a message for reasons sexual. What?
No, I just think it's funny the stuff they block. Boom. Boom, we did it. Big hype. Big hype, man. We we sold shit. We mined shit. Oh my god, we're tearing shit up, dude. It is insane how efficiently awesome we are. Oh my god. Yes! <sighs> Ladder hype. Look at that. Look at that ladder hype. What? Jay's gonna love that. He's gonna see that and be like, man, that X-Cal, man. Genius. Genius level shit. Rock pro. I'm throwing that shit away. Crazy. Processing. No. I gotta figure out this salvage thing. Like, what do you do when you're by yourself and you want to go fight something, but you know you're gonna want to salvage it too? Like, what do you do? Like, I need a I need a salvager that isn't like a whole freaking ship. Like, I need like a small salvager that's not ridiculous. Hmm. We need to make like a micro salvager. Well, where's my where's my little mining ship? We might have to make a conversion on that. Where's that thing? I haven't seen that in a while. Don't you have the small clip? Why not put a turret on top of that? Oh. Right? Oh, that's a, that's a great idea. Look at you. Look at you with the good idea. <laughs> what? Get script with the, with the clutch idea. I like it. Let's do it. Does this have enough CPU? I think it probably does. I think it's like nothing in CPU right now. Let's see, what are we looking at? CPU, 34,000 of 200. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we could probably put like a turret on here. Sure. Sure that's a thing. Let's do it. Those things are airtight, right? We're gonna... Yeah, we're totally gonna do it. Um, oh, this is flat blocks. I don't know, we'll look at it. Let's dig this up a little bit and see what we can come up with. Oh my god, like, calm down. I'm so excited. Alright, um... I gotta go drink something now, Jesus. Parched. All right.
Oh, I bet that... I bet it's gonna need more than a small generator though, right? Damn it, do I not have a multi turret? some drills well i got the little drill ship i mean if this doesn't work out the drill ship will definitely be able to handle a multi-turret but this has more cargo so this would be way better ah uh, that sucks These missiles are heavy. These hell, hell darts? Holy crap. Needs more. Needs more. Damn it. Expand it out and put a. I could. I, I could put probably a large one. Yeah, it messed it up a little bit. It's like 282 now. I mean, whatever. It's worth it if I can get this thing to work. 
Because it's the same form factor, so that's awesome. I mean, you know, we'll the final product will will clean it up a bit, but I mean, this is this is a no-brainer upgrade. I mean, this is awesome. This works. That looks like a solid copy, sir. Hell yeah. What? What? A micro salvager freaking cargo expanded dingy? Dude, un you know, put like four of these on your CB and just unleash the flutes, you know? Salvage style. Dude, that's insane. There's nothing better. If it could fold, that would be better. Like if it could pop out, but then there, there's no way I could achieve that. Or is there? I don't know. I'll be frustrate myself later trying to do that. doing that thing where I can't turn. What, what was that again? How did that get fixed? You gotta go turn off the thrusters? Stupid shit. Mm, still not working. Why you don't turn? Oh, right. Hold on. Um... That's a boom. Look at that, look at that pretty core. What? What? Oh, let's go kill something. I am going to kill something. The bludgeon modified edition. We got we got artillery, we got hell darts, we got well we have Xerax rockets. We don't have Xerax lasers because I don't have the ammo. But if I find a place to get ammo, we'll do that. But yeah, now I'm basically in search for a uh, for a fight. Is it the green place over there? Is that where we're going? Green place? Going to green place. We're gonna go find a fight, guys. We're not, we're not messing around anymore. 
Time to upgrade. It's too big. There's nothing wrong with it. It was just I just thought I could do better. So I built it even smaller. Cartridge just fine, dude. Plenty of people use it. There's a couple little more bells and whistles with the cartridge. Um, but just for like dumb space, like I I built the clip. Nothing wrong with it. Plenty of people uh are utilizing it and reforged and even as like a starter CV. Stryka, eh? Stryka's been here. Look at you. Look at you. I'm on to you, buddy. Oh, yeah. I see where you've been. Can't fool me. I need to put it on there. I don't think it's on there now. Cause I wasn't I wasn't completely sold on it, but now that now that we've played with it for a while, I'm pretty happy with it. Now that I was able to get it airtight. That was a problem. I couldn't get it airtight, but now that it's airtight, I'll put it up. I'll put it up for you guys, no problem. Oh look at all this gold here, huh? Shoot, see this is ah this always happens and you just don't have a miner. Damn it. Let's continue. Way too far. Two mining lasers to the right. Mm. Oh man, all these mining opportunities. This hurts. It hurts my head. It hurts my face. My face hurts.
Yeah, I gotta get those those navigational whatevers. Whoa. <laughs> Where, I look away from the conversation for like one minute and you guys are on anal plugs? Like, what the freaking hell is going on, guys? Oh, look at this place. Holy crap. That's, that's a lot of stuff. Well, it's mostly water, but... Rig. It's Rig's fault. I, I appreciate hey I appreciate it man. Do not put that in content suggestions. <laughs> What's a warp rift? Aha! Black hole. Get it. You know what I forgot is to bring cores. That's gonna be tragic. I mean... We could do it, it'll just be a pain in the ass on the first one. Cause we'll have to, uh... Find a generator or something so we can get basic parts. Or, I mean, I guess we could... That'd probably take longer. Seriously, nothing? Oh, this sucks. Yeah, 
Yeah, dude, like, this is, like, the two I've found, it's the same shit, like, nothing. That sucks! Wish I'd keep moving. Uh, Excal, do you need Cyrex laser stealth? I have 590 I can bring you. Oh, really? What, ammo? Yeah, ammo, I got all from looting. <laughs> so, yeah, dude. You don't use them? No. Yeah, I am kind of mad I didn't bring my little miner. I should have brought that. It was a no-brainer. I could have fit that up, like underneath on the back or something. Cause I bet I'm gonna need Pentaxid to get home. <laughs> Yikes. What? Okay, sir. Oh, two black holes. Oh, hell yeah. Hopefully, man. Hopefully, script hasn't been here already. I might have been. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh, War Duck got deleted? Community drive to help him get back. Where's he at? Give me a sector location. That's what I want. And yeah, I've been there. <laughs> Damn it. The other one is free though. Oh, okay. Other one's free. Sweet. Sweet, sweet awesomeness. What about this one? You do that one too? Oh, two of them are uh, undiscovered there, eh? Oh, well, well. I go along with the gold. So should I bring you the ammo or do you want to clear first? No, I'm fine. I, I have a little bit of it. But it's only, I think I only have one turret, so it's fine. All right, all right. Appreciate it, dude. Oh, you know what, let me suck some oxygen here. That'd be the worst, like you're in combat, you die of asphyxiation in the cat in this chair. I'd like some idea. So, you just manually fire the infectors, but in the in the case that you can't, like, what's the best thing to go for? Um, basically, just stay on one side and then turrets. So go for turrets. 
Yeah, because the one disruptor cannon is right next to a core uh, to the core as well. Okay. Doug said he's fine, he'll build himself back up. Hell yeah, dude. Big hype for War Duck. That's awesome, man. Oh shit, I don't have a long range scanner on this. That was an oversight. They are most of the time in the asteroid field though, so it's pretty easy to find them. Oh yeah, another thing, um, do not core the infectors until you get the advanced core box because there's a generator right next to it and it will blow up and kill the loot. Ah, uh, okay. I could, oh yeah, okay. I'm so bad with the inside of those things. Yeah, they kind of like a maze. Damn, I warp 550 light years, that's not... Get it, guys. We're going for big game today. Kind of. Big game. Well, big game according to me. <laughs> Time to see what the bludgeon can really do.
Infested station. Wow, good job, Sausage. That's awesome. Let's share that with Jay, man. He'd love that. Probably put three of those out. He's like, oh, it's great. I covered all this stone. I'm just, I'm just going to go mine stone. And then he'll probably just go out and mine all the asteroids completely. Just to get stone so he can be happy that he converted stone to something. Weirdo. <laughs> he gets so excited about it, dude. He talks about that shit off stream too. It's ridiculous. Like, all right, Jay, we know. Great, man. It's great that you're burning stone. <laughs> oh, you might need fixed artillery for the uh, meta converter, though. <laughs> the what? The one that you're flying right to uh, right now. Sorry. Fixed artillery for what? Um, the one that you're currently flying oh, to God. is the attack converter, the big spiral thingy. Oh, I don't want to do that. It's an easy way because when you shoot right in the middle, those are explosive blocks and that will take out the entire thing. And the loot will just drop, but what yeah, do you fix that. What do you get for what's in there? Anything good? Um, normal loot boxes, Ultra Rest 2, you know, the basics. And there's also a chance to get a quantum. So basically the quantum box. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't have fixed artillery. I mean, you could technically take out the turrets on one side and hop into your artillery turret and shoot in the middle as well. That could also work. Takes a bit more time, though. Yeah. Take it on jetpack. <laughs> I've never seen that before, I don't think. All right, I guess I didn't bother with it. What about is the infested station worth anything? Yep, also quantum. If it, I think it's the one with the infect, infector strip. Yeah, it has a shield, and the infector has a advanced core box in it as well. But that thing has a dreadnought shield, so it takes a bit to take it down. Oh, the station. Yeah. I do those two uh, bases at last after I finish the other stuff. Mm -hmm. If you can't find them, it also helps if you warp out and in again, because sometimes the detector doesn't work with the infectors and decimators. Oh, really? Yeah. Also, if you get a bit close to the infested station, um, the infectors and decimators kind of pop up as well. Kind of like reinforcements. But after some time, they disappear again. But yeah, long range scanner would be a lifesaver right now. Ho ho ho, more will be revealed. Well, well, well.
They decided to show their faces. Oh, it looks like they are stuck in the asteroid field. Three, three infectors. It's a hat trick, let's do it. Dive, dive, dive. Shields down. Do they disappear right away? Uh, no. They was uh, you just need to stay in the in the red distance. Yeah, I guess I need fixed artillery. That's probably the way to go. Yeah. What I do is basically, after I'm safe at one side, I just turn off my turret so I don't, don't do unnecessary damage and then just pop the core. How many artillery cannons do you have? Um, I have 12 on my ship. Fixed artillery. That's overkill though. You, I think you need 6, to in, six or 4 to insta-kill one disruptor cannon.
Oh, it's with the generator. It didn't like that, did it? Done deal. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Never know where the hell anything is in these things. Um, if you're in the middle, go to one of the walls and just multi tool yourself it exactly where you are right now is basically where the quantum is as well you know where the loot container was no idea um you see the warp drive right yeah um go to the warp drive ah oh, yeah the generator remove the generator and where the generator was there's the advanced box as well Oh, disruptor charges. Right. Yeah, you need those for the disruptor cans. You can get in the advanced core loot boxes as well. Oh, that wasn't a corner. Yeah, I think the loot table is right now disruptor cannon, small quantum, normal quantum, and disruptor ammo. Oh yeah, there's also a loot box that is kind of behind some blocks. <laughs> Shit, you told me not to do that too. Didn't you? No, now you're fine. You know where you remove the generator? Yeah. That's the generator that blows up the box. If you remove that, you're uh, you're fine. So you said there's another box where? Um, there is five in total. Um, the first one, uh, when you go back where you were, where you remove the warp drive. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> I don't know. Like, you know uh, what? Yeah. I'm just gonna salvage it, and then when things fall down, yeah, I'm gonna, like, yeah. grab There are it. in total five ultra rares, and it's... I mean, after you know where they are, it's kinda easy to find them. Yeah! Oh, no, I can see how that's totally easy. Yeah. No, it's basically just going around in a ring. 
until you hit one dead end, then you go back and go to the other end. That's it. Do I not have turning? Why don't I have turning capability anymore on this? Is it maybe down in the statistics? Oh, I guess it's just really, really bad. Okay. Oh shit, I forgot the I forgot the harvest box. <laughs> oh bullshit. Yeah, that's gonna suck. Alright, harvest. I wonder if I can even access it. <sighs> oh yeah, it's right here. Cool. It's gonna do that bullshit. Right, um. Win, winning. There's winning happening over here. That's that's you know yeah Gary man that that's a solid cappy I like I like where your head's at we're gonna do that I gotta remember to turn this thing off before I get out Jesus Christ yeah let's do that let's go um I need to spawn at least another one of these clips if not like two more. Transfer because that's the one thing about the bludgeon, it really doesn't have any cargo other than the ammo. I'll make more cores once I get well, once I get back.
Go to the side of the wall, he says. Find things, he says. <laughs> oh! Uh, stuff. Oh yeah, you messed a bit up. <laughs> I just need the money. Um, um, behind the wall where you looted the box, there's another loot box. Just remove the wall. You know, yeah, exactly that. This one here? Ooh, assault shoddy, eh? Now you know where I get all my epics, right? <laughs> ah. But where's the uh, quantum box? Um, on the where you were on the other side. Let's just go back where you uh, looted the one box, right? I found like a lot more stuff. Hold on. Small yeah, that's Big old matrixes. Hell to the yeah. Ooh, anti tank rifle and. Yeah. Yay! Stuff! Wins! Alright, um. I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about, but I'm just gonna. <laughs> just gonna freaking move around, freaking alien shit. I don't know where anything is. Um, you are kinda right where you are right now. Um, where you move the block, turn around, 180. You know where you looted the box in, uh, behind the wall? Yeah. 180. And, uh, uh, look at that, turn around 180 and remove the blocks there. You know where the blue circle is? Ooh, it looks like though you might have messed up the quantum box. Yeah. The generator, bro. Yeah. Shit. So it's not yeah. somewhere? It's not like on the ground somewhere? No, looks like the... From my experience, the generator, when it blows up, it completely uh, destroys the quantum box as well. And the content. Oh, oh no, no! Yeah, that's where the fix uh, come in handy. Damn it. Alright, well, let's try the third one. God, I hope I get one freaking quantum out of this. I mean, you still have the um, infested station and the other PY. Let's check. Right, so that's where I am. That's that. Where's the third one? Yeah, I'm gonna have to build a little micro salvager guy. I think like a micro salvage slash miner would be kind of a cool thing. Cause you know, honestly, like every ship you get in, like it would be make sense to have that, you know, as you're traveling around. Cause that's annoying. Like you see all these opportunities to mine and stuff. Uh, you are on the second one? Uh, on the third one? Yeah. Um, f uh, the four loot boxes are where you. Uh, where the gravity gens are there. You know, the uh, oh. small pipe, the blue pipe. Yeah, more just disruptor chargers. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, if you uh, deconstruct it, I think German said that it's 
some good materials. Yeah, neat. Does it give me more CPU for my ships? No. <laughs> nah, nah. Uh, in the gravity generator room above, when you go in, it's either above or underneath you. There's a little slot where you can go in for the loot boxes. Advanced turret upgrade kit and a large turret upgrade kit. What? That's epic. That's awesomeness. Uh, look above you. Where you entered the great general. Aha! Nice. Oh, another large. Oh, dude, the bludgeon is getting upgrades. Advanced heavy armor hype. Stuff hype. More stuff hype. Dude. Yes! Wins. Wins. I mean, you know, we're not getting quantums, but we're getting, like, yeah, we're getting good stuff, man. We need that shit. We need to be stronger. We need to be stronger so we can protect Jay Randall. It's a stressful job, man. Oh, maybe I shouldn't leave the, uh... Yeah, now I'm excited. I honestly, like, right now, I want to go in creative and start building a little... <laughs> oh, man. See, that's the thing. Like, you get into the game, you're like, yeah, I just got all this cool shit. And you're like, you know what? This miner sucks. I'm going to go make a better one. And, like, all the motivation just goes to that. <laughs> Hashtag protect Jay Randall. You got to, man. He gets in a mood, you know, and it's like, oh, you know, this sucks, and you know, I just, I just wanted to mine and and chop trees down, and oh man, you know, and it's like, ah, oh, socks and and stupid this and. <laughs> No, I appreciate it, dude. I want to definitely design something, though. I mean, that's that's half the fun of playing, is to get inspired to build stuff, so... Oh, yeah, no, honestly, like, um, well... See, with the drone stuff, um, it does take a while, right? But then you're guaranteed, but you're basically guaranteed the CPU. Like, it's, you know, as long as you put in the work to do it, it's going to happen. You're going to get probably 100 and you'll be able to uh, get yourself some uh, some better CPU. With this, it's, it's loot, right? So it's a hit or miss. It's like you could spend this time and 
not get anything, but you do end up getting, you know, some good stuff. So it's, I don't know. It's, uh, I, I think a mix of both is, is fun though. Like, you know, you, you're just always doing the drone thing. That's going to get old real quick. Cause it's a lot of looting. It's a lot of back and forth kind of stuff. This is a little more to the point, like ship warfare stuff. Like it's a little bit better. And you need the drone stuff for the warp drive as well. So might maybe save those up and go for quantums first. After you get the warp drive, then you can go for drones maybe. Because you need 500 drone parts for the warp drive. Oh, really? For the dark matter? Yep. Oh, shit. All right. Wait, why does this say O2 tank missing it? Oh, I, I guess I didn't save the blueprint. Well, this will just be dumb cargo. I'll just I'll just kill it after I'm done with it. Damn it! Oh. That means I don't have a copy of the fixed one. Just that one over there. So I gotta make a copy of that. Um, 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 um fuel, fuel, fuel. Alright, Rig. <laughs> Rig just won't let that joke die. Holy crap. Half block bullshit, damn it. Oh no, that's. Okay. Oh, there we go, okay. It was the landing. <laughs> Clip hype. You always got to carry a couple extra clips. Can't go to war with only one clip, man. All right. Wait. Harvest. Huh? Clip. Boom. Now we're free to salvage some more. Yeah. Probably gonna have to do another one, but for now we're fine. I'm sitting if you're at work watching this, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry you're not here doing the awesomeness. The stream is rated at TBMA.
So you mainly playing by yourself, Scrap? Are you, you you're in a faction? Um, or? I'm in a faction, but right now I'm doing the solo okay. farming and stuff, killing stuff. Yeah. He abandoned you? Oh man, crushing. Wait, that was too far? Oh, is that the line right there? <laughs> we hit the line, ladies and gentlemen. Boxes stay an hour, right? Um, the loot boxes, I think only 20 minutes or something. Your uh. backpack stays an hour. I'm finding the salvage more tolerable. I don't know if he adjusted it again, but...
Coffee should make you salvage twice as fast. Wait, is it? Why does it feel like it's going a little faster? Am I just making that up? Crypt, you still there? Yep. So, uh, now that you've done a 24 hour stream, would you ever do it again? Yeah. Yeah? Maybe sleep a bit more before next uh, time. Because I only slept for four hours before that. Oh, yikes, yeah. Yeah, otherwise, it was not bad. Yeah. The last hour was kind of better than when I started, to be honest. Yeah, yeah, you get that last wind, yeah. Same thing happened to me. Like, hour 18. 15 to 18 was like really bad. Yeah. I drink probably more coffee on that day than I dr uh, drink in a week. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, incendiary uh, minigun. Hell yeah. Hell to the yeah. What? Yep. Incendiary sh no sh minigun, yeah, minigun, yeah. Because when I took that shit out.
<laughs> really? First time playing with weight? Oh man. I could I couldn't play without weights and volumes on. That's crazy. That would be ridiculous. Yeah, dude, I mean that's just part of it. That's what makes it fun, especially in the beginning. Light Ion Blaster hype. That thing's OP against turrets. Uh, sorry, against sentries, not turrets. Small vessels? Have you been messing with small vessels at all? Like, I don't think I've even really brought in any small anything. It's just been... Um, not really. We used the one when we started out to get off the planet and warp, but yeah. otherwise I'm just using it mainly to haul my stuff to Anvil City and back. That's it. Yeah. I mean, you can do a lot of stuff though if you have the a uh, lot of the SVS uh, HV quantums. Right. I've been giving them away lately because I don't use them. Yeah, I mean the path to CV is just a bit quicker now, right? Like you can really even this, even this little guy right here is just way more functional to have than an SV or something, you know? Yeah, like... that's true. But it was fun to actually start out differently. Normally I would go towards a CV right away, but we used the SV this time. It was kind of fun, the drill 
you know, having to worry about getting killed instantly. Right. Thing has no turning, it's so weird. Uh, maybe it's down in under statistics where you can change the pitch, the roll, and stuff. Okay, no, it's full. One, hmm. two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I don't get it. I mean, it might be because of the large generator, maybe? It's just, like, really heavy now or something? I don't know. But it seems to move fine in every other direction. But it's just that one thing is just impossible. Like, this thing's barely... It's not even moving, I don't think. That can be a thing, though, because the gens are pretty heavy. Oh, look at that. Now it's moving. That's That's weird. Don't you think that the cryo chamber should work and we should be able to go AFK in them? Yep. Because I'm thinking, I'm like, you know, I'm going to have to go, like, make dinner, which means I'm going to have to, like, leave. And I would love to just stay in here so that this doesn't go away and I can salvage it later, but that's just not an option. That's true. Maybe kind of um, remove all the... Uh, the good shit. Yeah. And now when you're, for example, in the cryo chamber, you don't use food and oxygen yeah, and stuff. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. That'd be cool, but, man. But, yeah.
No, it's just a deco block. It's not even a functional block right now. I was just saying it'd be cool if it was. Yeah, I didn't put a core on this. I'm just realizing that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's fine. I don't think I can haul three infectors worth of shit anyway, right? Like, yeah. That'd be better than I mean, that. <clears throat> the raw C no is also good for trading, right? Yeah. Instead of having to deconstruct it all. Exactly.
added drone bays for CDs and different classes of drones you could deploy. Yeah, dude, totally. That would be amazing. I mean, you could do that in Space Engineers, pretty much. I mean, well, I don't know about salvaging. I don't remember salvaging being a thing, but I had mining drones that did that automatically deployed and be deployed. I mean, only to base, though, not to, like, not from, like, ships to out, because it's a fixed coordinate script kind of thing, or, like, you know, A to B and back kind of deal. Yeah, I mean, I think, you know, if they're gonna stick with this system of having a drone, it'd be cool if you could upgrade that drone. It'd be cool if that drone could do, like, better stuff. If it could, you know, if it could turn into a combat drone, if it could turn into a, uh, a high-end salvage drone, you know? I mean, I, that could be kind of cool. Because to me, um, I don't know, so, some aspects of the game are kind of tedious, and it would be cool if, you know... I'm not saying to eliminate the uh, building of salvage stuff, but I don't know. I, I like the idea of like a uh, a better backpack kind of suit constructor thing. It would just be cool if you can add, like, automation to your builds, like a, you know, like, like a block, you know, an AI block or something. And just, you know, that AI block would basically, you know, drone AI. And then whatever build you build, the drone will perform based on your build. So, you know, if you build a really crappy performing build and you put the drone AI in it, it's, you know, it's going to do it, but it's not going to be very efficient. It's going to be slow. It's going to, you know, whatever. But if you build, like, a really efficient build, um, you know, like like the Augur, right? Like the Augur S. Like, if I was able to put a drone AI into the Augur S, like a mining drone AI, and tell it to, you know, go mine iron. And it would basically go seek out with a detector, and it would go find iron within a certain radius, and bring it back. That would be cool. That would be awesome, because you're still building. But now you're building in an automation kind of way, right? Like, so, I mean, dude, that would be insane. You know, have, like, a scout drone, have, like, all kinds of shit. Get stuck on a tip. I mean, yeah, there would be a lot of, like, bugs. I could already see it, but... It's a cool thought. It's really a cool thought, because that, that would be next level, man. You know, and that, that would be awesome for the solo player, too. You know, I mean, it'd just be it'd just be cool in a bunch of different ways to be able to do that. Medical drone, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I think your personal drone should have some upgrade abilities. It should have the ability to med. It should have the ability to uh, to med you even at a maybe like a small passive state. Uh, slowly, you know, remed you stuff like that. Like would be really cool. But you, you'd have to upgrade it. Like it would have to be through either mission-based storyline, or it'd have to be through some unlock point or something. Something to that effect. Because these things are already in there. You already have a suit constructor for some reason, and it's only useful in the first five minutes of the game. Um, and through a bug, it's useful to store food. <laughs> but, you know what I mean? Like, you're not really looking at that thing at all after that. Unless you get wiped for some reason, and, you know? I mean, you're not really looking for that. So it'd be cool if that was upgradable to where, you know, you can do a bit more, um, you know, from, from the suit. I mean, screw it. You're already doing weird magical shit with logistics and stuff. Might as well own it and, you know, have that do some cool shit. I'm not saying it should be better than, you know, building something, but again, like, just, just a little more enhanced. A little more selective and enhanced. Like a class system. You know, enhanced digging capabilities, enhanced salvage capabilities, enhanced medical capabilities, enhanced food production capabilities.
I mean, imagine starting out with four people and they can all do a specialized profession. I was looking at Jay Randall's new uh, combat CV yesterday, and oh man, that is gonna be an awesome build. Like, uh, it's it's really good. It's gonna be really really good. It's gonna look amazing. It's Creel too, but I mean, it's like shit. It's more ship like than the Interfector. Like, it's it's gonna be good. Helmet, thank you. <laughs> that was quick. I didn't even, didn't even lose anything. So, rescue mission complete. Yeah, what happened? Word up? Yep, we cleared the orbit from. Uh, in Sykes territory from battle carrier to destroyers, reinforcements, orbital spire, and something else too. Five guys kind of going nuts on Cyrex. Nice. Did he get his stuff back? Or? Um, he got his ship back. I don't know how much is still of the ship left, but he got it back. Ah, uh, that's cool. Big hype. He's streaming? Uh, I think Warduck is streaming, yeah. Oh, you mean me? No, no, uh, Warda. Oh, yeah, he's streaming. I th uh, Grumble said that he's streaming. Alright, guys, I am just about done anyway. I was just gonna sit here and mine for <laughs> this a little bit more, so... Yeah, let's jump in there and see what he's, uh, see what he's up to. We'll catch you guys tomorrow for the Designers Challenge Stream 2. It'll be epic. We will see all the really awesome salvage CVs that you guys have come up with in February. Till then, guys, thanks a lot. Appreciate it, Script. Appreciate you being here and helping out, man. You're welcome. I will see you. All right, man. Later, guys. Thank you for the follow, the script HDX, and welcome to the flock. Hey, script. Excalibur just smashed raided Holy the channel with 44 shit. viewers. Excalibur just.